Here at Wolf Creek Ski Area, we got 1,600 skiable acres, 1,604 feet of vertical. As you pull out their trail map, and it just keeps unfolding and unfolding and unfolding and unfolding. In the last 10 years or so, we've started to expand further to the east, and it offers more of a hiking experience. You can kind of get out uh, off the groom stuff into some more gladed type skiing. Once you're over in Alberta, we have the Knife Ridge Staircase. You walk up these metal great stairs that are built into this rock wall, and this rock's all covered with lichen, and you know, the wind's blowing around you, and there's snow, and it's really exposed. Once you get up top, get ready to drop in for some deep powder. and here comes this little 1970s or 60s LMC old cat that comes roll, rolling down the road and turns around and backs up to the loading dock with this open expanded metal grate in the back. This is the horseshoe cat. Now we use it up here for horseshoe shuttle. And they just kind of load you in off the loading dock, tell you to hold on and... Another adventure, another one off the list. Off you go and it takes you up about 300 feet of elevation and a ways down the road and get to uh, another area of their backcountry, another bowl, and, and just a uh, pretty cool experience you wouldn't find anywhere else. Our snowfall is what really keeps people coming here. Our annual snowfall is 465 inches a year. It puts us getting more snow than any other ski resort in Colorado. Well, Wolf Creek is more uh, kind of down home, really kind of laid back. If you want to come and ski at Wolf Creek, you're here to ski. and. And that's what you do, and the skiing here was awesome. I think everybody that comes here definitely comes back because we have a lot to offer and a super friendly staff.